Hi, Daryl here with Dagsters to uh, show you how to install a One World Bypass filter on a Ford 6.7 diesel. One World Filters has come up with a kit for the 6.7s that includes the filter, the hose, and the fittings that you'll need to install your filter. There's also a new fill cap for your truck to where you can return the oil from the filter back into the crankcase, which makes it very simple and easy to install. Now here we are where the oil filter is attached to the block. Um, you can see the cable wiring that comes out right here that is the oil temperature sending unit and that's where you want to put in your T to put your pressure line for the filter out of that block. I will tell you that uh, and warn you that when you do pull your temp sensor out to have a pan underneath um, because it will leak out oh probably a quart half a quart of oil and it will make a mess. Okay, now you can see we've got the fitting in, the temperature oil temp sensor is in the 90 degree fitting, and I have it turned up so that what I will do is run it through the frame right here onto the other side so that it will come out on this side with my other hose for my return come back to the side of the, the body itself and there's two holes that are already pre-drilled in the frame of the cab I should say and that is where I will mount my filter. Okay as you can see you can mount the filter upright or you can mount it upside down which I prefer I don't do a lot of four-wheeling, uh, so uh, the filter hangs down farther when it's upside down than it is right side up, but it's easier to get the filter out, and then the hoses are up against the floorboard of the cab. Okay, now you can see the filter is mounted to the side of the cab. Oil lines go up into the fender well, goes through the fender well, to the frame, and over to the fitting that we installed where your oil temperature sender was or is. And then the hose comes up behind the battery from the fender well, up across the firewall. I have run mine down underneath my dipstick tubes and over to the return fitting into the top of your fill cap. Now this fitting that is in the top of this fill cap is a swivel fitting so you don't have to take your hose off to take your oil cap off to add oil when you change your oil, it all comes off in one piece. And there you have it, the One World Filter installed on a 6.7 Ford F350. I hope this uh, you enjoyed this installation nice and easy and if you have any questions you can contact any of the people on Daxters on Facebook and they can certainly answer your questions. Thanks again. Have a good day.